What's going on guys and welcome back to some more Sonic Adventure DX in the last part we uh, Got through uh, the last song stage and we're gonna uh, drown in the pool We're gonna drown in this area because I just want to show this off and in this part we're gonna explore more of the sky deck and We're gonna wait for it eventually, but you can drown in this area and I found this out during the recording Lots gonna come Yep, you can drown in this area, so, uh, yeah, pretty much any body of water, regardless of if this is in a stage or not, you can drown in it, and I'm gonna try to see if I can point out many of them. Anyway, so, um, like the last part, this part's post-commentary. The next two parts are gonna be post-commentary, because I actually lost the commentary, but, um... Yeah, and uh, Sonic's gonna have to find out to change the ship back to original shape. There must be a switch somewhere on the bridge. I've got to find it now. Anyway, so this is the first video uploaded where, like, uh, I'm trying to experiment with my content. See, like, my long form content is kind of like, uh, isn't doing as well as my short form content. So I'm trying to further optimize my long form content. There's, there's going to be chapters in this uh, playthrough for the first time. And, uh,. I've never really done chapters, but they drastically improve your search rankings, so that's why I'm trying to do that. Anyway, so you pull that switch, you, 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 get, you get out the chair, pull the switch, and uh, basically changes the ship's altitude. Then we get out of the door, and uh, now we're in an upper portion of the uh, egg carrier, and uh, once we go over here, as long as we don't clip the word platform, but... Um, Oh, I forgot about uh, I forgot about this cutscene. And there's chaos, but uh, more importantly, oh no, not again! Chaos. Could this be? The uh, yeah, it is Sonic. Yeah, it is. It is also chaos, but um. And look who's in the background, Big the Cat. <laughs> I must say, I must say, Froggy. So yeah, Chaos has captured Froggy, and uh, yeah, Big the Cat. Uh, let's just say, stay tuned on that one, because we're gonna get to him eventually. Froggy, I'm, I'm just, it's like. When I do the big the cat portion, I'm just gonna like uh, I'm not I'm gonna try to see if I can do a big impression. Anyway, so this is uh, Chaos Six, I believe. Yeah, it's Chaos Six. So he has he has six Chaos Emeralds now. This this fight's a little different. He, Eggman is gonna drop uh, ice things. You have to put when Chaos inhales. You have to kind of um, basically put them in his mouth, and you gotta attack him once he's frozen. And we're gonna, um, yeah, this isn't really a hard boss if you know what you're doing. No, I'd say really, there isn't really a hard boss in Sonic Adventure, to be fair. I'd say even like, a, even like, uh, like so Sonic 1 and the Genesis, like most of the Eggman fights, are most of the Robotnik fights are pretty easy. I was almost gonna call him Eggman, but uh, he's Robotnik in that game. I don't know, I call him Egg... He goes by both in Sonic Adventure, but pre I'm pretty much going by... E I've been going by Eggman this playthrough because he calls himself Robotnik, but, like, the the characters call him Eggman. But, like, after Adventure 2, the name just sticks, so because I grew up with a different era of Sonic, yeah, I'm calling him Eggman. And we just got to throw it in. Uh, one more hit and he's dead, but, um, yeah, he's dead. Hey, I'll play with you some other time. And more cutscene. Eggman, that is the third time you have said that. Sonic. And there's Knuckles. Hey 
there, Knuckles. Glad you finally made it. I thought you got lost or something. Until we meet again, Sonic! Stop! Come back here! And we jump off the egg carrier and land with no injuries back in the Mystic Ruins. And we land in the forest with no injuries. Uh, I hate Eggman. Egg yeah, that's what he's saying. Where's this? Yeah, this is the uh, forest in the Mystic Ruins, and there's going to be an opening. Yes, it is, Sonic. It's trying to show you the way. And that is, it was, it, that's going to be the uh, second to last of the Sonic levels. So we're almost done with the Sonic story. Now we can play with Big. And uh, yeah, stay tuned on that one. We're going to get to him eventually. It'll be much later in the playthrough, but we will get to Big the Cat eventually. Because, you know, Froogie... I think this might have been where I ended the part in the original recording, but, uh, yeah, but let's just say, uh, we'll just go here. Lost World, uh, this is the second to last of the Sonic levels. We have to go to the center of the ruins, so, uh, yeah, I like the stage, actually. We have to go back here as, uh, Knuckles, I believe. Yeah, we have to go back here as Knuckles. And like the last level, there's going to be multiple sections here. The later we get in Sonic, the Sonic levels, there are going to be multiple sections. And uh, let's just say, um, yeah, we're almost done with the Sonic story. And um, the story after this, we're going to play as uh, Tails of Story. We're going to play it in order from characters. Wow, I just lost my rings. But, like, uh, we're going to play it in order from characters. So, like, it'll be Sonic Story, then Tails of Story, then Knuckles of Story, then Amy Story, then Big the Cat Story, then E102 Gamma Story. And after we've done all those characters, we get a true final boss. So, we have to do all the characters. We only get the true ending. We're not gonna do like a hundred percent. Like I'm not gonna get like A rankings every level because um, even though you get emblems out of that, I just don't really find it like um, I don't really find it too necessary. Plus, it's like there's added context in the DX port that's like um, that lets you play more, that gets you more missions and all that for emblem. That it, it, there's more unlockables in the DX port. Plus, there's like metal songs that's unlockable DX port. But like um, if there's like I don't know, it's like. My goal with this playthrough is more to show you like how to play this game regardless of what port you're playing because even though Metal Sonic's only in the DX port, like it's not really useful if you're playing like the Dreamcast or the 360 or the PS3 port. This room is a little bit of a pain because if you fall in the water, A, you have to climb back up and B, you also have a risk of drowning. Yeah, we just have to get those three switches. We just have to wait for the uh, snake platform to come, and uh, we just have to uh, we just have to go back up there. I'm pretty sure if you want to get A ranking this level, you should not you cannot fall once in this area.
anyway, so, uh, yeah, another checkpoint, and I think I... And this is the, uh, we have to use the mirror to help guide us, um... Oh, yeah, we just have to use the light. Be careful with those enemies, because you can only hit them when their flames are out. Oh, yeah, this is stupid. Uh, I died here because I was trying to get the uh, shield, even though I already had a shield. So, yeah, that was a little stupid of me. Help the mirror help guide you, and there we go. As long as I don't die. Well, I got the shield this time, but um, you just have to go to the light against the mirror. So uh, you basically, oh shit! Well, I didn't die right there, but uh, and I think there's one or two more mirrors. I think there's one point we have to do light speed dash. Yeah, I think it's upcoming. We have to. Uh, yeah, it's uh, it's right here. We have to light speed dash. And now we hit the checkpoint. Anyway, this is the last area, and this is gonna. Uh, this is one of the last area. Actually, no, we got hit this. I can't sing the Indiana Jones theme that fast, but um, yeah, now they got that out of my system. I did that in the original recording. I wanted to do that here, but uh, yeah, we're going to uh. This is, the, this is one of the last areas in the, we just have to, we have to get these switch to kind of make these walls line up. We can run up walls like we're apparently Spider-Man. And we just have to run up the walls. Be careful because when you get to some of the walls, uh, they'll have like spikes they'll drop on you. If you get hit, you go, you go all the way back down. There's a checkpoint. I lost the shield, but uh, thank God I had it, but I got a one up. And I lost all my rings. So much for getting the one up. Well, I still have the one up, so I guess I take that back. We run up the we run up this wall right here. Be a little careful. I think this is the one. Where, yeah, this is the one where the spikes can get you. Again, if you want to get the A ranking this level, I'm pretty sure you don't have to. You can't fall at least once. And we have the light speed dash over here. And we're done with the level. Yes. Yeah, not bad. Anyway, so another cutscene. Cutscene, which, um, believe it or not, the emerald uh, place is gonna be on fire, so, uh, yeah, we have to go and investigate. What's this, What's this place, like Sonic is saying, which, uh, Where am I? This is really weird. 
Yeah, so we might as well go and investigate. More cutscene. And that's the la that cuts this last cutscene will be the last thing we do in the uh, part. So um, yeah, I'll cut it off as part of a uh, Sonic Adventure DX after this cutscene. Um, what was all that about? So um, yeah, so next time on uh, Sonic Adventure DX. Actually, wait a minute. Man's going to uh, chase him. So I guess next time on Sonic Adventure DX, we will chase after him. See you guys next time. What's he doing here? Oh, never mind. This time I'll get him good.